This video will teach you how to find the slope when you know two points of a line. In a previous video, I showed you the formula m equals the rise divided by the run. And we can also do a quick sketch of that by showing our x and y axes. And just draw a straight line. And we'd notice that we have two points and we have two coordinate values for each of those points, x1, y1, and for the second point, x2, y2, and that becomes x1, y1, and x2, y2 as we move from left to right of the line. We can simplify the rise as the difference in the y's, or y2 minus y1, and the run as the difference in the x's, or x2 minus x1. So we're going to use that formula and apply it to another situation. The example we're asked to solve says find the slope of a line that passes through the points 4 comma negative 5 and 8 comma 6. So begin by taking your values and plot those onto a graph. 4 comma negative 5 would be down there and 8 comma 6 would be somewhere up here roughly and it's just a quick sketch and a quick interpretation when I connect my points we're going to see our graph looks like this and I can say that it's increasing the first point is 4 comma negative 5 and the second point is going to be 8 comma 6 and we can move from left to right to assign values of x1 and x2 as well as moving left to right to assign values of y1 and y2. So now that we have those two values for each coordinate point, we're going to look at the formula m equals, or slope equals, y2 minus y1 divided by x2 minus x1, and we now have our values for the different parts. y2 is 6, y1 is negative 5, so let's substitute those in. 6 minus negative 5, all divided by x2 is 8, and x1 is 4. 8 minus 4. We simplify the top to be 6 plus 5 essentially, and that equals 11, all divided by 8 minus 4 is 4. So 11 over 4, or 11 fourths, is our final answer. I hope this video helped. If it did, please be sure to give this video a thumbs up. Let us know in the comments below video ideas you'd like to see. And please subscribe to the How To Scholar for more how-to videos.